Hello, the Brew Crew, and welcome back to a new episode of my uh, uh, save here, my uh, Football Manager 2018 save with a dairy uh, together, Ireland uh, on brandy. So yeah, here we are, and uh, we will do. I was thinking to not do this, but I actually saw that my uh, condition here is unsecure, so we will do this because I'm worried of getting sacked and I want to show you if I get sacked. Oh, we are not happy to m with a mid-table position. I mean, does it really matter if we get 5th or 6th? It's not like we ever have been better than... Okay, we were 4th in one league match, but that doesn't really count, so... Yeah, uh, we have... But we will have a lot to go through today, so let's just get right to it and go on the results first. We have played, um, where was our recent match? I can't even remember. I can't remember really. I think it was this Bohemian. And then we have Limerick. We got a draw. Pretty happy with that. Uh, corner. Or the guy that unfortunately is going to his American there. Or uh, Aquin, he, so he is going back to uh, America. We sold him there. Not the best because, ah. Oh. But well, we got money and, and we are not a super rich club. And he, I mean, he's not, he's okay against Limerick. Pretty happy with that. Uh, we won against Cork. 3 uh, 1 here. Um, Kurt is actually scoring a goal. Rory Hall. Uh, Rory Hall is developing really nicely. Only 21 years old. One of my favorite players so far, actually. He's really, really good. Can play as well as in a offensive midfield role. And he's Aston Villa project, so uh, he is something for the future for sure. As you can see, we struggle a little bit away, so that's not the best. Uh, Shamrock Rovers, uh, we lost 3 2 here. Mark Quinley, uh, wasn't, or maybe I'm mistaken. Yeah, he is a former player for us. Coyle and uh, Rory Hall again scoring a goal there. Sadly, our defense is not great, but we have made a huge signing here. Um, I was I was just checking on free transfer or whatever, and then it popped up a uh, old um, Irish international <laughs> player that was on uh, yeah available to sign. Yeah, sadly we lost this match. It was pretty close, so a little bit unfortunate there that we did not get more really. I feel almost like we deserved at least a draw there, but uh, well, not too much to do. Uh, Bray Wanderers, we always better than uh, Curtis and Armin uh, Aganovic, and uh, I really like this player as well. Um, ben Dorfri, he's pretty good, uh, also pretty young there. Uh, Hop Kurt, and uh, I have to actually show you this just Ben Dorfri because this. Goal was pretty amazing still, or whatever. So yeah, there he has the ball. We can actually highlight him in there. There he runs, and then he shoots from <laughs> way out there. So it's pretty fantastic uh, goal score there. And, uh, what for the fortune, they seem to be our boogie team, really. I mean, I'm so annoyed we d did not did not win here either in the red bohemian in the last match uh, we were so close to actually getting a victory for once but no we got the draw both team had a shot at um, post and we scored in night the first and was oh well we will win this then they scored in <laughs> minute after so yeah, unfortunately uh, draw again, so it's not going great. We just won victory in uh, what is it, six matches or something. So we are a little bit inconsistent, but still, we are not. Uh, we're not going to get relegated. I would still like to be better than Portford, though. 
and as you can see they're five points up to Shamrock Rovers sadly so and then um, Europa League was drawn the first qualifying round and uh, if we go through here um, they're pro <laughs> I'm probably not going to get sacked though <clears throat> I guess we will see. Hopefully, I will not at least lose. So, Shiva Habel uh, Bier Shiva. Oh, I actually know some of these players. Pacinovic, uh, Rosales, uh, Sacardo. Who is this? Where is he playing? Okay, Barcelona. Yeah, so we will go on the transfer. Yeah, we. Sell sold Greer a door free because he wanted a new challenge. As you can see, he's been pretty loyal to the club for a while, and it's even a own product there. But yeah, he wanted to go out, so I let him just go. We did not get super much money, but well, and White side also got loaned out. Uh, so we signed, we had some players, yes, I believe it, most of these signings is from my director of football, so some of them are not great, but it is, at least we get a little bit better whipped, uh, yeah, whipped here um, with some of the players, so Mike Sykes is least have potential, that is probably what I can say with both of them, none of them are really going in first 11 really. Uh, Mark Dorfrey, we have uh, actually a decent, he's not superb, but he's, at least we have a, I thought why not actually sign someone, I think I was actually, um, yeah, or saw them together with my <laughs> director of football, I wanted at least a backup for Dorfrey there, uh, so Dorfrey. <laughs> Almost the same name. <laughs> it was just a coincidence they really have the same name. He can play as well. Uh, um, central midfielder James Bowen. This was a sort of a more of a chance signing. I thought he would be better, but he's actually not, sadly. So I don't know how much he's going to at least. Oh, he had two years. I thought this was just one year, but well, it's actually a pretty decent leader as well. So I guess we will see. He's the Englishman there, James Baldwin. And then we have Ian uh, McCowan, a uh, new first teamer. Uh, or So he played eight matches for Wart for there, but then he's played a little bit League 1 and League 2 in England. Uh, so yeah, yeah, I guess his atrocity isn't great, but it makes him yeah kind of kind of suitable actually to, as a sweeper keeper. Or he can Grims has done it decently, even if he it just says that he's too started. But now we actually have a player that's good enough for um, Irish Premier League. And then we got John O'Shea, <laughs> 30, 70 year old. Really, okay, his speed is terrible, but <laughs> just ignore that. Here he looks brilliant, and he's. I thought, uh, I thought he would be too expensive uh, in wages, but actually, he's not. And uh, he played last season championship uh, football. That's pretty good for, to go from championship football. Okay, it's step down for him, but it's superb for us, so. Yeah, and a lot of Premier League uh, seasons here. So he, I think, also he, it's not, it's not uh, unexpected, or it would not be surprising if he want to be become a, what do you call it a, a coaching staff uh, as well after the after the. His career has ended, so yeah. But oh well, uh, so yeah. Uh, he has really good uh, stats for us, really good marking, really good leadership. Uh, yeah, all run jumping reach is still great. Uh, natural fitness also, the only thing is pace is a little bit of lack, you know. But compared to the other one, we can compare here with Gavin 
Pierce, uh, John Shea is not going to start today, but yeah, as you can see, really none of them are really that fast. Pierce is pretty old also, but he's still five years between them. Um, but yeah, John Shea is still better. Yeah, we are going to try to play the at least the first match against the, uh, this uh, Israelic team as well. But we are going to start off with this match. And uh, fortunately, yeah, we have a goalkeeper injured as well, so that's not brilliant. So we have Grims in goal, uh, Mac McDermott, Pierce, Ag Agonovic, uh, Daughtry, Sykes, Hall, McGeanf, uh, Curtis, McDorf, and Hopkirk. And on the bench we have uh, Rory Patterson that is back from a long-term injury. So yeah, I was, uh, I have been checking out some other players that actually are like really, really old because <sighs> I know it's not <laughs> good long-term maybe, but sort of right now we just need a really good team all around. Just um. And don't, yeah, we just need players that are like better and then we can focus at getting better youth players in. If I can find any youth players, of course, there's a little bit of struggles with transfer since that's what I'm going to say are not that great. As you can see, they're two stars, so it's a little bit difficult to attract players, even if I scout, scouted some players that are really good. And the only players that seem in. Ooh, Hopkirk! Yes. Scores. Uh, the only players that uh, appeared interest are those who. Uh, uh, are just about the same. Or not even worse. So yeah, they did put coffee on the bench. Also, coffee has been a little bit inconsistent or whatever recent matches. Uh, oh, I don't want both match that there. Oh, great save there on the... Ooh! Oh, whoa! They saved twice from open goal there. That was pretty brilliant of the opposition there. But finally, um, away. I guess it only makes sense for us to win this match. <laughs> like, even if we've been in bad form, you can Sometimes if we even meet like better team, we're still like winning <laughs> because it, it we are unpredictable <laughs> I guess that is sort of a good and bad thing McDor free McNeef and free now we are dominating this game away I don't know what is up with St. Patrick Athletic as you can see there they are second in the table, but you can't expect it or you can't really you don't expect it with this sort of, and for once actually we have all, uh, we have a full uh, full uh, substitutions here as well. I will get Oshia in, and then he probably can play both of the matches since we are in the beginning of July, but not too much more, I think. Since, yeah, uh, sadly going out there. So I'm trying to find, but like I said, it's not easy. I hope that we get a decent youth intake. Maybe some players that even good enough to start in first team because it's still Irish Premier League and I wouldn't say that the players are like superb so if you're really lucky uh, you might get players that are actually better 
but oh, the, the problem as well, it would be great if we actually uh, would kind of surprise in uh, um, Europa League to make some money there. Curtis, ooh, scoring again, 4-0. Curtis is brilliant here, Hopkirk. Uh, I might get Curtis out. This might be actually one of the best performers so far. I don't know if we win have won with this as much uh, before. I mean, I've not seen a single highlight from St. Patrick, St. Patrick Athletics. I, w I was uh, choosing this match uh, before and which be just because I thought it wouldn't be really close, but no, I believe, I believe we played against them before in like the first match of where so I'm sorry that it was the same chance of getting sacked or whatever. Uh, so yeah, I will probably rest some players. Let's... Okay, now it at least says that I'm stable, but I guess we will see. So I will probably be back for the match against um, that Israel like, team, at least the first match. Yeah. Hello, and we are back here, and we have uh, basically the same lineup. Uh, I did not decide that I could register John O'Shea. But I did not decide to start him because his match fitness is still terrible. And actually, Pierce and uh, Ganovic has still done it pretty great. So, I'm gonna give the. Yeah, I'm, I'm not starting with him. And uh, Coffee as well is benched for this match as well, just because. Yeah, it's not done it that great. So. And so, yeah, we are huge underdog. We are five times the money to win this match. So, I don't really know if we should expect anything, to be fair. But I don't see Superman and I believe most of the players are also great. So, that might help us out. Oh, we score after three minutes. Oh, a little bit sad to see that we're not full. Oh, no. What's offside goal, sadly? Well, well. We started off good here, though. Sakardo. Curtis. Hall. I'm probably just going to play these two. I don't know how many. I think it's for, like, three. Uh, um... Qualifying matches we have to go through to make it to the playoff, which the playoff is just before the... Oh, Curtis, as you can see, he scored like madness on the uh, left wing there, so really lovely to see, and... Uh, James McDoffin. I don't know, I'm not I'm terrible with his name, I call it... Can, all the Mac, <laughs> I can't say them. So yeah, hopefully... Not concede too many goals here. That's the most important. Great inception there, Pierce. Winning that ball. And Grims has surprised me. Some of the players, their sets doesn't look that great. But Grims has done it brilliantly. He, I thought he was definitely second player. Oh, Hall goes through and he scores. What a lovely move by Rory Hall there. And we are 2-0 up. So we're pretty good. Um, chance to go through here actually, and as you can see, there we have negative uh, uh, goal difference in the league. And I would say as well that the uh, Europa League matches, if we go far in that, they will uh, I will prioritize them before because there will, if we go far there, we will also increase like both our reputation and the league's reputation. So yeah, makes sense, and as well, not this season, since we are not even... Uh, I guess we should not really expect that either. I mean, I've not seen any chances from the other team so far. Um, we're clearly the better team out there today. They even make a change, because they're not so unhappy with 3 null, and I think we're pretty good here. <laughs> I shouldn't say too much. I should just nickname some of the players. Is that Curtis? Ooh, great save there. And clearance by Sacardo. Clearance. 
Clearance again by Zaccardo. He says that their savior here, it seems like. And Rory Hall scores another goal. It's his breakthrough in the national scene. No, I don't know. It's a, a surreal like team, but still five times the money to win this match. So I believe most of the time the, the game goes. Uh, on reputation, who it's going to win and such, so yeah. Curtis scores again! <laughs> I, I'm just going to call him James. Or James Bond, or whatever, so... I, w I will give some of the players nicknames, because I can't... <laughs> I can't keep up with the... He might leave, though, so it might be really... We need to get him match fit. 4 nil. I thought maybe we could get to like 3 one But not 4 nil here. This is apostrous. <laughs> Where I thought maybe, uh, maybe we can get a draw. Like 1-1 uh, one, one or 2-2 two, two or something. Now it's all, almost a bottle. Look <laughs> up if we... If we... Um, don't go through actually. <laughs> oh no, 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 no. Oh. Don't like that. Now they just have to win with 3 0 at home, and that's, that's not unlikely to be fair. Hall, as you can see, there has been brilliant so far. Um, Boyle is better as a. Uh, Shadow strike. I need a really good shadow striker because no one really works in that position. But Sykes gets a brilliant chance there but for uh, going out here. I mean, we should almost lead with more. How dominant we have been here. Boyle shoots again. <laughs> we're shooting a lot, but we're not getting it on the br two brilliant performers today. <laughs> I'm so surprised, actually. Especially since, yeah, our form is very inconsistent. Went for a lob or something like that. So, yeah, I will... Uh, I might actually record... Uh, next step. Oh, no, no, Jan O'Shea! No, 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 no! Ooh. Oh, it's been great in uh, Manchester United, but... I feel like he should be brilliant just here, because this is a lower kind of level. <laughs> should almost be dominate, as you can see the uh, appearance or the comparison to other. Oh wow, wow! Four one is enough. I'm not. I'm, I'm still not even sure that we will make through it with four one. Since uh, we were such, a, well, it might be just, it might be just a game that sort of underestimates us or whatever. Okay, so um, where was he? Uh, corner. A job will go out actually, as you can see there in the next. Yeah. Oh, we have Limerick in the league as well, so I'm probably will play. So yeah, we'll play that and then. We'll, uh, or we will play the, the second match in the next. It, it might be a shorter episode since this was so long. So yeah, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this, those two brilliant matches there. Uh, so yeah, um, ho hopefully a more stable crowd to stand on now uh, as a manager. So well, uh,